Hello viewers, hope you're doing well. Today in this video, I'm going to create a components and we will also register the components in app.js as a routing. So let's get started. In the src package, I'm going to create a new folder with the name pages. Under this, I'm going to create a new folder with the name dashboard. And the second, I'm going to create here header. And the last, I'm going to create here auth. Let's create a component for the header. So let me create here the new file with the name header.js. Let's create here the basic structure of the component. Before that, you need to install an extension. You can see here the extension that installed in my VS code. I will attach the extension link in the description. Let's write here RAFCE. Hit enter. And you can see here the basic structure of the component. Let's create a dashboard component. So let me create here the new file under the dashboard package and name of the component that is a dashboard.js. So let's write here RAFCE. And you can see the basic structure of the component. After this, in the auth package, I'm going to create a new folder with the name login and the second folder that is a sign up. Let's create the component for the login. And you can see here the basic structure of login component. Let's create the sign up component. Okay, all the component created successfully. Let's go to index.js and here I'm going to wrap the app tag with the browser router. Let me shift this tag between the browser router. After this, let's go to app.js. Let me remove this code. So first I'm going to add here the header component because it will static for the application. And after that, I'm going to add here the routes tag where we have a different route. Let me add here the first route with the element login. So the path for this component that is a slash login. Second route for the sign up component. the path for the sign up component that is a register and the last row for the dashboard component so let me add here the dashboard component and the path for the dashboard component that is a slash dashboard okay so let's go to ui we can see the header component so let me add here the url of the dashboard component and it will be a slash dashboard let's hit enter and you can see dashboard component loaded successfully let me add here the path for the login component and you can see login component loaded successfully let me add here the path for the sign up component and you can see the sign up component That's all for now from my side. I hope you like this video. If you have any confusion, you can do comment. And also subscribe to my channel for more videos and hit the bell icon. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye.